in the midst of all this absolute madness of Man United letting Eric Ten Hag go, we have a game this coming Wednesday against Leicester in the League Cup, which to be honest, I actually forgot about because all we're speaking about is Eric Ten Hag and Ruben Amarim. So I've actually almost forgotten about our game that we have tomorrow, which we will see Ruud van Nistelrooy in charge of Man United when they take on Leicester. What can we expect from this team? I know exactly what we're going to expect from this team. Um, I will speak about that a bit later. But I think the fact that we have so much talk about a new manager, um, obviously Ten Hag is now gone, we move on. Super positive, but we're here to speak about Man United taking on Leicester in the League Cup this coming Wednesday. Welcome to the Red Devils Den. Let's get into this video. Man United will play their first game just a day after the sacking of Eric Ten Hag. A day and a bit. Uh, with Ruud van Nistelrooy currently at the helm on an interim basis, we're told, apparently. Um, who knows how long that'll last. But what can we expect from the players? Because the players, as always, are left behind when a manager leaves. Firstly, what I would say is, we are definitely going to win this game against Leicester. Um, we all know the last time an interim manager came in, who was a legend of the club, who had played for Manchester United, we went on, I think it was an eight-game winning streak, 11 unbeaten. And I think that will start this coming Wednesday when Man United take on Leicester. I am honestly expecting a score of nothing less than three goals from Man United. I can see us going up to 5-6 in this game. Leicester are a good team. They have been playing decent football since they've been promoted back to the Premier League. They've had some interesting results. Obviously, they have a threat. Jamie Vardy is always the biggest threat. But I want to speak about Man United and I am are seriously seeing a massive win for Man United. The players have to do what they always do, which is show to the world, show to the fans that the manager was the problem and it was not them. And I promise you, I would be extremely confused and shocked if I do not see a massive result tomorrow. And I mean, in terms of score, these guys are going to go out and they're going to score big goals. What was Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's first game uh, when he came in? I think the score was five or six and all. Uh, we beat his old club, Cardiff. Yeah, Cardiff was his first game when he came in. I think we won that game 6-0, 5 or 6-0. You can let me know your thoughts um, if that was correct or not. And I'm pretty much assuming the same thing. I've already seen tweets on X speaking about how Ruud van Nistelrooy conducts training. He's seeing a lot of, we've been seeing a lot of running, um, a lot of inverted um, fullbacks. So it's going to be interesting to see. I think these players are going to do what they always do, which is prove to the world that they are not the problem and the manager was a problem i would be i would be pleasantly surprised and i think it would be quite funny if luke shaw came back in the next three weeks or two weeks or something that'd be very funny uh but anyway uh who do i think the team will be i think the team will be pretty much the same thing we've the same team we've been seeing with eric ten hog i think it will be um our our four at the back masrawi the Lert. maybe actually johnny evans might come in for this game i don't think so though but onana in in goal uh, I think we'll go with a very strong lineup. Maybe Johnny Evans will come back. I don't know. Uh, but I would go for our strongest back four, which is Masrawi, Delet, Martinez, and Dallo in front of them. Will Ugarte play now? Why is Ugarte not playing? I really don't understand that. Um, I, would, I would go Casemiro, um, Ugarte, Bruno Fernandes. Obviously, Eriksson will play. So that, But this is my team. I know it won't happen. But I would go with Casemiro, Ugarte, and Bruno Fernandes. Marcus Rashford, Garnacho, and Hoyland up front. I am assuming, like I said, the team will stay the same. I don't actually see Van Nusselrooy doing too much. I'm sure he's been told that we have a new manager coming in. So just kind of steady the ship, make sure we're not losing, which I think you will be able to do because I know the players will be out to prove a point. Um, <coughs> when it comes to this game, obviously we have to compete really really seriously in these cups and in these tournaments because the premier league is obviously not going very well to be honest the europa league is not even going very well so we really have to focus extremely hard and seriously on the fa cup and on the league cup when it comes to that my score prediction believe it or not i'm gonna go for 5-1 manchester united winning five goals to one i think we're gonna see a goal fest 
I think we're going to see energy from these players. We're going to see a high line. We're going to see attacking football. We're going to see intensity from the beginning uh, because we've been here before. We've been here before where, yes, results weren't going well under our previous manager. And there was some sort of player revolt. Some players already coming out saying the tactics weren't that good. We weren't very good going forward. We weren't very good in defense. Well, whatever it is, I do know that we are going to see a response from these players. And it's going to be for the, for the betterment of everyone. Um, when these players play well, we win things. Uh, we win games. So I, I do foresee us going on a decent run of maybe three, four games on the spin winning. Uh, not even just drawing or not losing. I actually think we will go on a winning run at least until a new manager comes in, which we're hearing a few different stories on that. But uh, like I said, I'll go for a 5-1. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoy the content, remember to hit that subscribe button. What will we see from Man United? I think we will see the players bounce back. We'll see the players give their all because they will have to prove, like I said, that they were not the problem. The manager was the problem. His tactics were the problem. His style of play was the problem. But let me know your thoughts in the comments. I think it's going to be interesting to see how exactly we play this coming Wednesday, but it's going to be an interesting watch. I'm sure we will win. I'm sure we will win by a big margin. We'll blow Leicester away unless something in incredible happens, but I'm sure we'll blow Leicester away. But let me know your thoughts in the comments and I'll see you in the next video.